Hi guys, it's Hanny from Eclipse All Sports. I just wanted to bring you a quick clearance cricket bat video review. So we've not done the individual reviews of these KG Limit Edition Pro Cricket Bats. Uh, we've now put them on clearance. Um, so the probably only reason they haven't sold is because we haven't done the individual reviews. So two of these three bats are featured in our top five bats. Uh, so they are cracking cricket bats, there's no doubt. Uh, but we'll give you a closer look now and then you can make your own decision. So you've got Grade 1 Plus English Willow. Uh, for me, it's probably not the nicest looking grains, but they're not bad. You've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 evenly spaced grains. What you do get is a 40mm edge. Uh, a 65 millimeter spine but it's a nice even thickness all the way up and you've got a nice thick toe 25 millimeter toe at the edge and you're looking around a 28 millimeter toe in the middle so it's quite a thick toe all the way across if you have a look through there you are getting a little bit of concave to help keep the weight down um, because like you see there you've got a massive spread of weight across the blade so very even shape all the way across so plenty of wood in the hitting area. This bat is only weighing 28.4 ounces, so you are getting a lot of wood in the bat. Spine up into the handle, slight semi-oval at the bottom, round towards the top, double textured grip with the camo effect. Uh, the stickers are all textured and embossed. You've got a square toe, and if you have a look there, the grains are going pretty decent through the toe, no toe guard fitted. But yeah, we'll just have a look at the bow. Nice bow down towards turn. If you have a look there, you can see how thick this bat is. So yeah, these bats were originally on for £375. And we've now put them all on clearance for £299.99. So for a top grade one English Willow Cricket Bat, it's excellent value for money. Um, so we'll go on to the balance and the pickups. So 28.4. Uh, for me, it feels nice in the hands. Probably feels a little bit lighter, probably about 2.8. But yeah, comes through the shots really well, feels really good in the hands. And the most important thing, we'll just see how it taps up. So yeah, the rebound is very good. Down low, you've got plenty of wood. Right down at that toe there, nice and thick toe. Still getting really good rebound down low. And in the middle, absolutely goes. And then up towards the sticker. You still get a pretty good rebound up towards the sticker there. So yeah, very good response all the way across the blade. Um, so we'll move on now to cricket bat number two. So you're getting a few more grains on this one. You've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 to 12 grains on this one. Edge size wise, you're looking at 38mm edge and a spine height of around a 64 millimeters. So yeah, nice even spread of weight again across the blade. Uh, toe thickness, you're looking around a 22 millimeter toe thickness at the edge and around a 26 in the middle. Spine up into the handle again, slight semi-oval at the bottom, round towards the top. And again, you've got a little bit of wood taken out and those grains are going nicely through the toe. Show you the boat, nice boat down towards the toe. So this one is weighing in at 28.7, so still a nice light weight. Uh, the face is fairly flat, these edges have been nicely rounded. We'll see how it picks up and then give it a tap with the ball. Yeah, it feels nice in the hands, picks up quite well. So it probably picks up again around the 28 mark, so a little bit lighter than the dead weight, and we'll just so we'll just see how it taps up. So yeah, the rebound is good again. Seems to be pinged well all over the place. So KG have done a very good job at pressing these bats. The performance is excellent straight out of the packet. So don't going to take a massive amount of time uh, to play in. So we'll move on now to cricket bat number three. So you've got nice even grains. You've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then a ninth one just down there at the bottom. 
Edge size wise you're looking at 40mm edge and a 64mm spine. This one's weighing at 28.8, .8. lovely shape again. Around 22-23mm thick toe at the edge and 26 in the centre. Spine up into the handle, uh, semi oval handle, medium thickness, round towards the top. Again, slight concave in the back, just to help keep the weight down. And those grains are pretty decent through the toe. Nice bow down towards the toe. Again, same flat face, rounded edges and flat toe. So we'll see how this one picks up. So for me, even though this one is the heaviest on the scales, it picks up really well and probably feels again around the 2.8 mark. So they all feel about the 2.8, uh, but this one picks up really well for its weight. And we'll just see how it performs. So yeah, the ping on this one is very good again. Very good rebound. Very impressive performance. Just pings everywhere guys. So they all perform really well and, and they're all offering really good value for money. Um, so if you're interested in picking up one of these bats, simply click the link in the description. Uh, like I say, you've got a massive £75 saving. Um, you also get a free KG padded back cover and free UK mainland delivery as well. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up and a like. And if you haven't subscribed to the YouTube channel already, then please do so. And I look forward to bringing you plenty more video reviews. So until next time, guys, I'll speak to you all soon. Bye-bye.